What's going on guys, I'm Emma H2 and today I'm bringing you a new vlog. Today's vlog is going to be an away day at Accrington Stanley. Accrington Stanley? Who are they? I've never been here before, it's a new ground. Um, what am I hoping for today? Well, we've uh, appointed a new manager, Stuart McCall and Kenny Black. I'm happy with the appointment. They've brought in two new players called Ike Yugbo and Jack Allenwick. Um, I haven't heard much about Ike Yugbo, but I know uh, Jack Allenwick um, being a good player, Keeper at Port Vale, he's had a few games at Rangers, so uh, why not give him a, try, a chance? He's experienced, and uh, when I have watched him the few couple of times that I have, he has been quite solid in that, so I'm happy about that, and uh, quite confident with these two in charge. I can't be any worse than Nick Dawes, surely. Uh, but yeah, I am getting on the coach, it's currently about 8.53. Uh, the coach is going to be leaving around 10 o'clock, so yeah. If you do enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you when I get on the coach. <laughs> Well, three minutes in, and already Accrington have had a uh, chance. Bit of a goldmouth scramble, really. I don't really know what happened. Well, a few blocks, few shots, and luckily they missed. But looking lively, Accrington. So, uh, first corner game to Accrington. Oh, how oh, they've not scored yet, I don't know. It's just diabolical. Still. I don't know what happened at Barnsley, I missed that one. Maybe I'm at Jinx. Played really well at Barnsley. Or against Barnsley, maybe I'm just a Jinx here. So it's diabolical right now. I don't know how easy we want to make it for Accrington, but this is unbelievable. Again, another chance. Just got his foot to it, then just went past the uh, far post. But it's all Accrington right now, all Accrington. Lots of work to be done with Scunthorpe. Great pass by James Perch there to their winger, who whipped it in and they've said it just had a shot over the uh, bar. Well, that's disgusting. Nothing's changed so far. I reckon Dawes is in crowd somewhere. Really do. First shot in anger. Uh, Matt Ellum about 25 yards out over the bar. But it's not been, we've not been up to much really. It's uh, last five minutes or so, we've maybe got a bit more hold of the game. Played it a bit more, had a bit more of the ball, but in all fairness to Accrington, they're playing really well. And Say, like I said, I didn't see it against Barnsley, so I can't comment. But we seem, we just seem slow to the ball, not closing down. So I don't know. And McCall, every time the, the back have got it, whether it's Burgess or McCarthy, shouting them to uh, carry it forward. We don't want them to lump it upfield. Just keep carrying it. So we'll just see how that goes. What a save by Jack Annick then. He's definitely going in. But it's all accurate to We've had a couple of spells where we've had five minutes at ball, just peak. Passing it around their uh, area, enough, coming to nothing, no penetration. But Accrington are just through us all the time. It's just, uh, I don't know, there's something, there's a mentality of the players, I think. McCall's got, you know, obviously he's only coming this week, but he's got a lot of work to do with them. Just lucky. We're just lucky. We are lucky. So, I don't know what's going to change at half time because I just don't know, but it's just nothing. It's only going through the motions and not very well. Dragged it wide of the post, Humphreys. But, um, oh yeah, if we score, it'll be an injustice to Accrington, really. Again, to Accrington. Oh, close. Same old time. Apart from that, went on target. Right, it's half time, still 0 0. Um, how disappointing, half to be fair. Uh, you know, McCall, Kenny Black, they, they hadn't really had time for the, to get the team to sink in. I still think it should be a definite three points for the. Uh, today, though, um, still could be a possible three points, but Al Alnick made a a quality save and uh, impressive save for his debut here and you know he's commanding the box quite well mate he did make a quite a sloppy mistake uh, near the start but you know he's only been here a couple of days but first half not very good at all um, Jordan Clark, McArdle not really talking all over the shop midfield all over the place you know we've had our chances but Accrington could be three or four now up in this game it's just not good enough and uh, I want to see Cole Cuff come on, I want to see Ugbo come on, give him a chance, Novak doing nothing, he's just too slow, he's just, you know, not good enough, he's just... I want to see Andy Dales come on. Yeah, him as well, that, that won't be a bad place to come on, but it, first half, shocking, not very good, but hopefully second half we can come on for a strong performance, we're shooting our way, get Cole Cuff on, 
They've got a dodgy uh, centre back that we tested like mad when we played Rotherham at home. He's sloppy, he's not very good, and can capitalise on this. So get Colcuff on, get Ugbo on, and let's get some goals. Come on the iron. So the second half started off like the first. Accrington straight into it again. So I don't know. Hopefully we'll make some changes soon. We need to. Colcuff for the great run, then pass it out to Steve Humphries. Humphries a shot. Mighty Lund's going ballistic at him. Absolutely ballistic. Jack Allen. Give him a rocket up that ass, man. Ah, yeah, do that as well. Absolutely amazing save. Good run by them. Just play through the middle, though. Mid midfield, just along the floor. There's nobody there. Just massive spaces all the time. Up, will you? Quick corner as well. Back stick as normal, and it's uh, out. Yeah, Thank goodness. But yeah, it's, we just I don't know what's, uh, what the issue is. But they're just not switched on at all. Not switched on. Oh! Oh, just had a shot on target and nearly scored. But, first time of it, Cloud as well. Okay, so uh, this is just shocking, still. Shocking. I know we've got a new manager and he's got to work with the players, but just carrying on. It's just um, dire. They've got another corner again at Crinton. But it's probably about 20 minutes left. Get Andy Dales on, get a bit of pace on, inject something. Cold Plus come on at half time. Absolutely amazing. Best player on pitch for us. His feet is fast, it beats his man. There's just no one in the box for us when he puts the ball in. So, but yeah, just get Andy Dales on, other side. Let's go for it. Last 20 minutes. Okay, so uh, free kick to Scunny. Cold Plus just got brought down. Yep, there we go. What a corner. Got a goal kick. Okay, so two minutes later, as I said, Dale's about Dale's coming on. He's actually coming on, he's just come on for Humphreys. Hopefully. Dale's on one side, Colcuff on the other. We can attack him. Get behind him. Get some balls in, decent balls in. I don't know if I took Humphreys off. I thought he'd, you know, chase stuff. So, well, there we go, he's done. So, last 15 or so now. Maybe 18, free kick. Go on! Oh! Put back across by Burgess. Novak just got in for the thing, got pushed into the post, ended up in the back of the net, keeper landed well, on top of him. Get up from that, I think. But yeah, he's definitely injured. I think he's banged out on the post. So, but yeah, so close. Yeah, so far, okay. Corner. Go on. Go on. Yes! Get in! Come on! Get him, Lund! Oh, Matty Lund, my favourite player. Get him! Get him! Come on! Get him! And Atkinson got a corner. Oh, and they've just scored. They've deserved it. I'll be honest, they have deserved a goal. Corner swung in about the 15th one or so. And this time they managed to uh, get it on target. So, game on again. Oh, great save by their keeper. Took a big deflection, he's got his hand to it going in otherwise. But yeah, got it away, clawed it away. Great feet by Colcuff then. He lost down his feet as well, got his shot away. Just past the post. With a three minutes uh, stoppage time. Got about a minute, minute and a half of it. Got a free kick. About 25 yards out. Also, Morris is over it, so is Lund. I don't care who scores, it's going. I meant in the net, not in the crowd. That was a bit shocking. Oh, so close then, Ugbo. Chased the ball down, keeper hit it against him, just, uh, well, went wide of the... Accrington are in right now, just bear with me. Offside. I think it's going to kick this out, full time, we'll find out. There's the full time whistle. One all. Oh, we've been a bit lucky there. In all fairness, I think Accrington deserved three points. But um, defence definitely very fragile looking. So, um, but yeah, Ugbo came on. Looks quality. Hopefully, we'll see more of him. Cole Cuff when he came on at half time, also quality. Should have been on from the start. And Dales, a bit of pace as well. Didn't get quite into the game the same as the other two, but you know, did a job. Well, that's that. But one all. Yeah, we were probably expecting to win that against Accrington, but we didn't. So, uh, yeah, on to the next one. Just on the 
long way home now. Uh, I ended up uh, coming back with my dad because he ended up making the game, as you can see, because he's in the vlog. Um, the result ended 1-1. Uh, I'd say we got lucky. Atkins were very good, and uh, their keeper made a really good save near the end that we could have probably snatched three points. But uh, to say how bad we were that game, I'd, I'll take a point. It's, it's better than nothing, and uh, we move on to our next game. I like the look of that uh, Aiki Ugbo. I think I could, that's how you pronounce it. Uh, he did look very good. Him and Coco linked up quite well together, and maybe if we can get them starting next week, we might be able to see a few goals come in. Uh, we, we had spells where we were good, but Accrington were definitely the better side that game and, like I said, probably deserve to take the full three points, but I'll take it. Uh, if you have enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe if we can hit 30 likes on this video, that'll be great, and hit a like target in a while, and subscribe if you're new. Uh, yeah, so thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.